matters, but I guess that was a question. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Why is there like Elden stuck in <laughs> I'm just like finding the names. And <laughs> Dang, it's already starting. I haven't even. Ah! Okay, Jazzy Fish and then Travi. Oh, well, they're on opposite sides. Um. Okay, I will start commentating this match once <laughs> I get their names in. Um. Wait, is, I don't know if Travis is like. Yeah. Alright. Wait, it is zero, zero. Okay, so now I can start commenting this match, and holy crap, why is Inkling all the way at 100? <laughs> okay, and now, oh wow, literally in like a second, he just got all the way basically to even. Jeez. Alright, so this is winner semis, this is gonna be a best of five. Winner advances to winner finals, and dang, that side B just keep kept going. Okay, that was really nice by Jazzy Fish. So getting that first stock lead was really nice, but I mean, Game and Watch can literally end it. Any sma click any smash attack. <laughs> um, so yeah, exactly. Starting to click the smash attacks, and there we go, bomb. Just get him. So in this matchup, I mean, I might be, I'd be BSing you if I. You know, knew and started to say like, "Oh, this is what happens in this matchup," and started theorizing. But that was a good reversal. Oh dang, he's not dead. Okay, he tried to get that up B to try to gimp him, but I don't know. Inkling was never gonna get gimped there. At least at that percent. Um, but yeah. So far, like Jazzy really turned this around from like the very beginning. Whenever there was that, uh, he got like a hundred damage. And the up throw up air killed that early. That is stupid. So up an entire sock, about to lap him in percent. But that was a really good bomb. I guess I should call it forward in that bomb. And I really like that by Jazzy. It's like if he sees him doing like the chef, he's just like, you know what, I'm just gonna hit like neutral B. You're just gonna get gunned. And it's like there's no need, so it's chef and neutral seems really bad. And that was a really good back air. Oh no, he might be dead. No. He should have just stayed on. If he would just stayed on, then he could have just like reacted to anything. That was bad. He shouldn't. He didn't need to like go low or jump or anything like that. Because he could have seen him go like. He could have seen the angle. You know. If anything, what he could have done is he could have jumped down and then jump back air. So that way he it would be like a rising back air and he would hit at the very bottom at the very beginning. But, yeah. Not able to edge guard either. And then almost getting that board smash. <laughs> Both of them just clicking smash attacks. Like get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> Jeez, parry the up smash into roller. What the heck? Who does that? <laughs> Alright, that's 1 0 Jazzy. Trying to think of like what stage Game and Watch would want. Versus Inkling. Maybe like. Okay, Battlefield. I can see Battlefield. Like, Nair pressure. Like, his Nair is like so big. So it's like getting stuck on a platform and just like Nairing. All over the place, nearing like trying to catch his run off of the platform, nearing catching his jump, stuff like that, and also like up airs keeping them, like basically you keep up near up near up up airing him until he's able to land on the platform, and then that's when you start your air pressure. I would assume, I mean, <laughs> that's why it's a good stage for Game and Watch, but who knows? Yeah, big near, big near, big near. <laughs> But the, the thing is, it's like, he can just like control so much space. That's why I feel like Smashville might might have been good for Game & Watch, you know? But, Jazzy just starting out strong again. Almost gets that dare. Oh, that was a really good attempt. Just not able to execute it correctly. And so far, Jazzy just kind of, kind of just doing really well. <laughs> I'm, I'm not really watching, I need to watch him a little bit more closely to see like why he's getting all this damage. Um, okay, run off Chef. I'm assuming that was a... Wait, can he bucket the ink? He can bucket the flat bomb, probably. Yeah. Down tilt will be punished, yeah. That's why I like Inkling down tilt. I'm, I would be always hesitant to go. I mean, Inkling should get for it, but it's like, you can, you can just get punished for it, you know? Anyways, Roller takes it. He's gotten so many stocks just from Roller. And right now, Jazzy Fish does not know how to deal with this Inkling. 
Okay, I was good following him. Uh, see, yeah. He's able to just, like, keep him on the platforms and keep him in disadvantage really well, but how did he get that back air? <laughs> That's so crazy. I don't know, it just seems like Jazzy Fish is getting a lot of his, like, confirms. Like, whenever he hits you, he just hit, 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 hit. But, like, whenever the Game Watch is, you know, hitting Jazzy Fish, it's, you know, like, hit, hit. Dang, and these rollers are just catching out these Scott dodges. He needs to, like, oh, dang. That sucks. <laughs> Trying to juggle someone who has a really overpowered dare like that. But, like, he, Trivy needs to really worry about the, um, or look out for the, um, I don't know, I don't know, rollers. He's getting hit by rollers way too much. But it's definitely not far from perfect. Like, yeah, it, this is kind of even. Jazzy, like, just, just has a bit more, like, momentum. He's just been hitting him a bit more, you know? Yeah. I don't know, Jesse is like doing a good job at just keeping him out. Basically a lot of backers, which is like what Inkling will do. You know, just backer, backer, backer. Yep, he's going just for like spacing backer now. Oh dang, that was, I really like that up air to like try to catch the jump, except people won't normally jump out of shield on a platform. Um, so if like you go to do an up air on someone, or if you go to do any sort of aerial and they're on a platform and they're in shield, if you don't hit them with the aerial, they're probably still going to like stay in shield. But... If you uh, do hit them with the aerial, the shield's going to get a little bit lower, and then they're probably going to jump out of shield or run out of shield or something like that. So it's like, I don't know. But, like, inkling so fast, I can probably just, like, short hop and, like, maybe, like, jump, like, jump bear land or something like that. I don't know, something stupid. I don't play inkling. <laughs> yeah. Jesse Fish is playing a really good, that's the thing. He's playing a, wow. Oh, my gosh. And we have a completely blue game in March. Jazzy Fish is playing a really good keep away game. But that's the thing, it's like, ooh, I don't agree with that roller. Like, I know you've been hitting him with roller a lot, but that was a bad roller. Um, yeah, just, just like, <laughs> keeping away, and like, Game Watch is the one that's having to like, chase him down. Like, run in airs, and run in forward airs, and stuff like that. Oh no. Oh, that was a really aggressive grab. Oh dang, probably because he was like, oh, he's in up throw up air percent. <laughs> I think he is, I don't know. And there we go, another roller. Dude, like, Trivy really needs to be careful about these rollers. He just keeps getting hit and hit and hit by them. Um, I know the names are on the opposite sides of where they are. <laughs> I could change it, but I'm not going to. It took me, like, literally a year to do that. I still agree with Battlefield. But yeah, it's just he just gets, like, whipped punished. It's just, like, Jazzy will, like, not Jazzy, Trivy will, like, I don't know, just do like big aerials. Not big aerials, that's not what I'm trying to say. But just do like very committal options, trying to win neutral, and all Jazzy just has to do is like, you know, dash back roller. You know, avoid the aerial, ro aerial roller. And that usually will. And then Jazzy kind of like panics whenever he sees the options, because like a lot of the times he's been like hit with, um. Like he gets hit with a spot dodge, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, that jab is so tilting. <laughs> <laughs> getting hit by Inkling's jab is the most tilting thing ever because it's like not only does that animation take like forever but it's like you see the ink pile up on you and you're just like jeez dude get this ink off of me that was really good classic nair up the up air <laughs> yeah it's like see see this is <sighs> you're, just, you're just like and, okay, I'm sorry, but that was kind of an unga bunga side B. I, like, Jazzy didn't do think of anything except press side B. <laughs> and like Jazzy, I'm not. Yeah, and then Travi just like took it, just like uh, I'm not moving. That's the thing. It's like Travi, Travi needs to do a combination of just moving around more. I guess like in neutral, like he can't just like be stationary doing nothing. I don't know. That's like any character, but it Jazzy looks super in control of this match. Uh, I thought a backer was gonna happen there. Oh no. See? <laughs> you should have just held it, to be honest. But, like, uh, every time I play Game & Watch and I try to just, like, smash tech only, I always, like, not do well. <laughs> Dang, Chair killed him early. Chair is powerful. Yeah, but I don't see, honestly, I don't see how Travi can, like, bring this back. I mean, it, it, he's got a mountain because it's like, not only does Jazzy Fish have like momentum right now, but it's, 
I don't know. It doesn't seem like Trevi has an answer to Jazzy's hard reads. Jazzy will just like hard read and be like, okay, I'm gonna hit you with roller. Okay. Jeez. Oh, so we can bucket the thing, but it's not powerful. Okay. Um, I mean, it's Game & Watch, so it's like, Game & Watch is the king of, you hit me, I up B, get a little bit of damage, I juggle you, and then I kill you at like, 90. <laughs> From down smash, forward smash, or something like that. So it's like, he's, he's not out, he's actually doing a little bit better, because he's like, moving around a bit more. And he's like, being a little bit less, I guess, committal? Yep, up smash chair. <laughs> the classic. And he's back in this. Okay. He might make me eat my... Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. <laughs> that was commentary curse. I was about to say, he might make me eat my... Where's he doing well? And then just forward air. That was a really nice forward air. He hasn't gone for that in the entire set. But... 